Opinion, the Trump administration's next target, naturalized U.S. citizens. The Hill. Even documented, immigrants will not be safe because Miller has declared that he will pursue the S. Eldam used process of denaturalization to go after people who have been citizens for years or deca. Day. Below are your comments. Suspicions about purported fraud on their naturalization applications wouldn't Musk fall into this category? Didn't he originally enter the U.S. on a student visa, but instead of going to school, he developed a computer program that he subsequently sold? My wife was born in a foreign country to a father from that country, but to an American mother. Yes, birthers, my wife is a U.S. citizen at birth. I was born on an American military base overseas to two American parents. But my passport doesn't state that, it gives that foreign country name as my place of birth. I think we'd better start carrying certified copies of our birth certificates at all times. Two of Trump's three wives were naturalized citizens. Melania's naturalization was under suspicious circumstances. Trump's mother and paternal grandparents were also naturalized. His paternal grandfather reportedly entered the U.S. illegally in order to avoid the German draft. Trump has said that he will issue an executive order to cancel birthright citizenship for anyone with H1 or more parents who are in the country illegally. If Melania and Trump's grandfather are both declared illegal retroactively, then Trump, his siblings, children, nieces, and nephews would all lose their citizenship. If denaturalization does not apply to dead people such as Trump's grandfather, then it would still a PPLY to Melania and Barron would lose his citizenship. Luckily for Trump's family, Trump has no authority to change the interpretation of the 14th Amendment. T. Tart with Musk. Would this include individuals who got in under an Einstein visa even though they have no intrinsic s bleep or abilities to back it up other than stripping? Dot. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.